All right, Shalom. I'd like to start off by giving all praise, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father, Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh, Bahasham, Racha, Chodash, and double honors to my elder apostles and my elders at Great Millstone or GMS. And I want to say peace and blessings unto the elect of the nation of Israel, all right, which consists of you so called Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans, and Hispanics. All right, and the brothers and sisters that look like the other nations because we've been scattered. All right, this is the brother Atazaria from GMS Houston. And um, this is maybe about two nights ago or a night or so ago. I can't exactly remember, but um, I was visiting. I was on a little visit, okay, and um, the TV happened to be on. And this commercial came on, which is a uh, Hennessy exo commercial or exo hennessy whatever okay so like you. um and i was watching it you know i glanced up and i was looking at the commercial i'm like man that is weird and freaky man okay and i'm gonna kind of uh go through the the video the commercial and i'm gonna pause it because i want to show what's being pushed on this on the world really but um but more so on the the generation or or this generation rather on uh the minds of the, this generation okay so as a matter of fact what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna cut the volume down because that's not necessary all right and i'm gonna push play because the words are gonna come up on the bottom of the screen but um it is just weird it's just a weird and freaky vibe man okay um matter of fact before i even get started let me bring out a scripture let me go to the book of romans okay let me get a quick scripture let's go to romans And this is the book of Romans. Oh crap, that's the wrong chapter. Chapter uh, 12. And uh, I'll start at 1. It says, I beseech you therefore, brethren, by the mercies of the Most High, that you present your bodies a living sacrifice, holy, all right, acceptable unto the Heavenly Father, which is your reasonable service. And this is the point. Okay. Because this is what the elect is going to do. Okay? They're going to present themselves holy. A living sacrifice that's holy, meaning separate, meaning pure. Okay? Would it, you know, a holy sacrifice acceptable unto the Heavenly Father? The Most High hates the form of this world. Okay? So. What's pleasing to the Most High is not what, what is going on in this world by the masses, okay? That's why he's going to destroy um, the the ways of this world and those that uh, are conformed to it, okay? It says, verse 2, and this is the point, Romans 12 and 2, and be not conformed to this world, okay? Because the way of this world is is, is wickedness. Okay, and the Heavenly Father is against it. All right, so let's go through this. All right, and we'll get a couple of scriptures. All right. Um, and I'm going to push play real quick. And, uh, like I said, the words are going to come up on the bottom of the screen, but just check it out. Look at the, uh, like the brother in the camp I always say, it's, it's just a motley crew, man. Okay. Um, just, a uh, uh, this is, uh, a, uh, a, a, a representation of Babylon the Great, okay, a melting pot of scum, okay, and you'll see as, as this, this, uh, commercial plays, so let's push play, all right, and I'm gonna be pausing it through the video, Okay. Take a seat. 
Okay, and you got to look at the people. Check the check these people out, man. I'm going to go through it and I'm going to come back. She ain't have a one on. Okay, and you got the fruit flies doing their thing. Okay. Well, no, let me go back a little bit. Just a smidgen, all right? I want to get that. We're all you've ever known we're all you've ever known okay meets all you haven't yet okay come as you are all right i'm gonna bring it back because i definitely want to get leave is more more is made okay let's go back i want to kind of pause it a little bit and catch a few things. Matter of fact, we can actually pause it about right. Okay, right in here. All right, look at her. She don't have one on. Okay. Then you got this this one right here, down here in the left hand corner with with lime green hair. All right. Okay. Get into the mindset that. Okay. The mindset. This is the mindset, okay, a filthy mindset, okay, because you got to pay attention to where these captions are posted with the frames, okay, and all of this um, plays into the thought patterns of people, all right, especially this generation, okay. So get into the mindset that there is no mindset. Well, there is a mindset. The Heavenly Father just said, be not conformed to this world, but be ye holy. Okay, roughly paraphrasing. We're supposed to be holy and acceptable to the Most High. That's the mindset. Okay, because it all starts in your mind. Okay. That's the mindset. Not that there is no mindset where you, where you do as the Alistair Crawley says, do as thou wilt. Do as thou will, okay? That's that's uh the the mindset of an anti that's an anti-messiah mindset. Okay? Let's go on. And then you see, as soon as he says that. There is no mindset. Just be a it, this one back here where the mobas and uh, watermark is a fruit fly. These three are all fruit flies. Okay, just sashaying and whatever. Okay, see the one with the hat. He's passing it over to this one that's twirling his neck around in circles. If it's even a dude, who knows? You see, that's the thing. We live in Babylon the Great, a land of great confusion, okay? I want to get to this point, okay? We're all you've ever known, okay? We have what looks like a Jake and an Edomite, an Israelite and an Edomite, you know, coming together. Yeah, okay. What is the most I think about that? He's not with it. Okay? This is the Tower of Babel, man. Okay? They want to bring all these nations together. And the most High has never been with that. Okay? He separated Israel. Okay? Israel is supposed to be separate. All, all these nations are supposed to be separate, man. All right? We're all you ever know. Let's keep going. Okay? With the little handshakes. Where all you ever know meets all you haven't yet. Look. And you got two women sitting there holding each other. And then the layout on this table reminds me of, of what would be at, a, at the Met Gala. Which they just had. Or, or, or uh, these uh, elite society uh, banquets and... Uh, uh, um, you know where they get together and they they have all these weird freaky parties, dressing up as you know, 
I mean, what I'm talking about is the table setting. None of this stuff that's on the table makes any sense. Okay, flowers and whatnot. And as you see, again, under the Mobazin watermark, right there in the right-hand corner, that looks to be the scripture sitting on the table. Now, let's keep going. Come as you are. And what is this in front of her? Lo and behold. That's the scriptures, man. Come as you are. The scriptures don't say come as you are. That's not in the scriptures anywhere. The Most High has rules. Okay? He has standards. He has laws, statutes, and commandments that are set that we are to live by, which that is what is pleasing to him. That is what separates us from this world. That takes us from the, the being, being of the form of this world. By following what thus says Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. Okay. Come as you are, huh? And like I said, that's the scriptures in front of her. You see? And this commercial is only 30 seconds long. But I just stopped there. I just kept looking. I was like, man, this is all kind of crazy, man. Okay. And I'm going to make this point. This liquor and stuff like this is called what? When you go to the liquor store, it's called spirits, man. Okay? And what kind of spirits are floating around in this place? Look at that. Okay? Let's go on a little more. And I, right there, that one, to the uh, left-hand side, that might be a dude with makeup on, man. The weird little hairstyles, the dreads, okay? This is all kind of weird and freaky. Leave is more. Yeah, more demons on your ass, okay? More is made by the many. Hmm, yeah, you right. The many makes more demons, okay? And you see, it got a lot of Jake in there, man. A lot of Jake. Okay? They toasting to that. All right, so that's pretty much it on the commercial. But we'll go work right here. Okay. Right up in uh, there. We'll stop it right there. That's cool. At the come as you are, huh? Yeah. Well, I want to get a couple of scriptures. All right. The first scripture I'm going to get is in, um, matter of fact, let's just go to Second Peter, the second chapter. Uh, and start at a verse, uh, let me see. This is Second Peter chapter 2, and I started at verse 5. It says, And spare not the old world, but save Noah. Okay, so the old, old world was destroyed and spared Noah, the eight persons, a preacher of righteousness. Okay, that's what we're preaching, that's what the elect is going to be preaching. Okay, righteousness, man. And this, what you see on the screen, is not righteous. Okay, let me do this. Right, let's do this. Uh, cut on the airplane mode. Just leave it right there. That's all right. We don't need no connection. We got a connection. Okay. Um, just as he's not going to spare this world. Okay. But he's going to save a remnant out of it. Okay. Eight souls made it that time during the flood. That a small little group, a small little group is going to make it this time. Then it, the elect, all right, 2 Peter 2 and 5, and spared not the old world, but saved Noah, the eighth person, a preacher of righteousness, bringing in the flood upon the world of the ungodly. And see, these, these, this is an example of the ungodly, man, Okay. This is what me what it means to be conformed to this world. Just weird, freaky, 
freakisms, man. Okay, doing whatever is pleasing to the flesh. Okay, getting full of them spirits and doing whatever is pleasing to the flesh, man. Okay. It says, in turn, uh, 2 Peter 2 and 6, and turning the cities of Sodom and Gomorrah into ashes, condemned them with an overthrow, making them an example unto those that after should live ungodly. So, Sodom and Gomorrah was an in, in sample. It was an example. Don't be like this because this is what will happen if this is the way the world is. Okay? Verse 7, and delivered just like, you see? Vexed with the filthy conversation of the wicked, just as we are. Those that sign, they cry for all the abominations. All right? Vexed with the filthy conversation of the wicked. And this is our wickedness, man. Okay? So the Lord delivered just like, all right? Again, destruction and deliverance. Okay? Um, Come as you are, boy, boy, boy. The scriptures don't say that. I just got to say that again. All right, let's go to the book of Jude and let's get verse 7 because Jude is only one chapter. All right, so this is the book of Jude, chapter 7. Even as Sodom and Gomorrah and the cities about them in like manner, giving themselves over to fornication and going after strange flesh. Is that not what you see in this video? That's exactly what we see in this video, man, or in this commercial, okay? Going after strange flesh, all right? It says, giving themselves over to fornication. This is outside of the temple, okay? This is outside of righteousness, okay? And going after strange or other flesh, or set forth for an example, suffering the vengeance of eternal fire. You see? That's what's going to happen to this place. Okay? Babylon the Great is going to be no more. As a matter of fact, uh, I'm trying to think. It's Deuteronomy. Let me see. Can I find it? It's Deuteronomy, the 29th chapter. Let me see. Well, uh, bear with me one second. This is Deuteronomy 29 and 23. It says, uh, Deuteronomy 29 and 23 and that the whole land thereof is brimstone and salt and burning that is not sown nor beareth all right nor any grass groweth therein like the overthrow of Sodom and Gomorrah Adma and Zeboim which the Lord Yahweh overthrew in his anger and in his wrath and that's the same way Babylon the Great is going to be, man. Okay, nothing is going to be sown here. Grass ain't going to grow here. It's going to be burning and pitch. Okay? This place is going to be utterly destroyed and never inhabited again. Okay? It's going to be left as a, a memorial. Okay? Um... And this place follows after the 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 pattern as those cities, okay? A uh, filthy, disgusting way of life, man. All right, which is not a way of life; it's actually a way of death, okay? Um, I'm gonna end it right there, man. This just caught my attention, and I thought, you know, well, might as well do a lesson on it, okay?
So with that, you know, Lord willing, this was edifying. And I'm going to end it right there. And uh, it's on to the next one. Until then, I say shower warm.